Hey there, Jerry Spangler here. Uh, just wanted to rant a little bit today. I was uh, this morning. I was on my way to meet a friend for breakfast, and uh, we meet every other Wednesday for breakfast at Panera, and talk about life and family and uh, jobs, careers. And all the way over, I like to listen to talk radio. And the talk radio host um, was talking about uh, how sometimes in life you have to suck it up and uh, just move ahead and I agree with that and then uh, one, of, one of his you know the guys you can't hear on the radio they're talking to the host but you can't hear them and they repeat what the, the programmer said um, he said uh, apparently he said he had to suck it up this morning and come to work at 445 um, and, and that's a mentality that a lot of us have and, and I thought you know wow you got one of the best jobs in the world uh, at least I would see it that way. Um, why are you having to suck it up to go to work? And and I thought, you know, if, if we have to live life um, getting up every day, having to suck it up so we can go to our job, uh, go to earn a paycheck, go to work for somebody else's dreams, then wh why, why are you doing what you're doing? You know, I'm, I'm pretty proud of myself throughout my career, uh, my working life. I've I've really never had to do anything full-time that I really didn't like. I've always enjoyed what I did, what I do. And so I've never felt like I have to suck it up to go to work. Now, there have been days I've felt that way, but as a career and a, as a whole, I've never really felt that way. I've always enjoyed what I do. And I just want to lay down a challenge. You know, if you're in a position right now where you're having to drag your butt out of the bed every morning to do something that you really don't like, um, to earn a paycheck for somebody, that, someone that you don't respect, or to buy someone else's dreams and give yours, yours up for them and their dreams, to give your most precious working and waking hours every day of your life uh, to pour into someone else's dreams while you just uh, get by on the paycheck that you're stuck with. If you're in that position, I just want to challenge you to look inside. You know, there's more to life than that. You know, do whatever it takes to get out of that position so you don't have to suck it up to get up in the morning. I mean, you know, think about it. Life is short. <laughs> it's just, you know, your kids grow up, they're born one day, the next day it seems like they're gone. And we spend those years working uh, and being at, at the whim and beck and call of somebody, somebody else who doesn't really care about uh, our families. And, uh, you know, if you're not in a position, great. If you're not in that position, great. Good for you. Uh, disregard this video, but take the challenge on anyway. Make the most of life. You know, make life count. You know, my, my website, meetjerryspangler.com, at the top, my, my tagline is make life count. And I really believe that. You know, if you're waking up every morning having to drag your butt to work, um, not enjoy what you do, not get any reward or fulfillment out of what you do, just want to challenge that. You shouldn't be in a position where you have to suck it up every day. Life's a lot more precious than that. That's all I have to say today. Uh, I wish you the best and hope this has challenged you. Uh, just like that radio show challenged me this morning. It took me, uh, took me aback a little bit and made me think. Signing off for now. Take care. Hey, you know, I almost forgot. If you are one that feels like you got to suck it up all the time to get to work, and you just dread Monday mornings and you can't wait till Friday and the only thing that you work for really is a paycheck there's no reward no fulfillment then go ahead and take a look at what I do um, it won't hurt um, I have a lot of fulfillment in what I do I enjoy it I work from home uh, I get to spend time with my family and I'm not bragging that's not the point of this just trying to impress upon you that there might be a better way you can find me on a couple of places but my blog site is www.meetjerryspangler.com. Check it out. If you like what you see, give me a shout. Contact me, and I'll talk to you. I'll share more with you. Talk to you about that. Take care now.